Also breaking tonight, massive flames ripped through a three-story home in Worcester. We're learning firefighters had to rescue at least two people. NBC 10's Diane Cho spoke with a witness. Firefighters are still out here now keeping an eye on hot spots. A witness we spoke to telling us tonight that a mother and her young daughter were rescued from that window on the third floor. Firefighters say this started around 8 o'clock tonight here on Cohasset Street in Worcester. You can see these flames pouring out of this multi-family home. Witnesses say the flames are shooting out at least 15 feet high at one point. Firefighters say the two people that were rescued were taken to area hospitals with non-life-threatening injuries. They say it took about an hour to get this fire under control, but they did say there was a partial roof collapse. Eight people in all are now displaced, and firefighters believe the fire started towards the back of the building. We talked to one man who says that he was driving through the area at the time and saw the fire trucks and pulled over trying to get out of the way, not realizing the fire was right behind him. People in the front window over here and um, watched them rescued them out, and then they pulled the dog out. I grabbed the dog, tried to help give it CPR or whatnot, just try to bring it back to life, but didn't make it. And uh, it was scary for the family and for all of us around, screaming help and whatnot. And I couldn't, I wish I could help more, but hopefully they're okay. Firefighters say that there is extensive smoke and water damage to this building. The Red Cross is now helping these families who have been displaced. The cause of the fire is still under investigation tonight. In Worcester, Diane Show, NBC 10 Boston.